Hey, this is Luis here one more time from Creative Worship Sounds with another patch tutorial for the song called Overflow by Planet Shakers. Hope you guys like it and let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so before we get started, I just want to say thank you guys for all the support I get from each and every one of y'all. This has been an amazing year for Creative Worship Sounds. So let's go ahead and get started with this tutorial. Let me just say that this patch has some incredible sound designing and the sounds that they use for this particular album are just amazing and it took me a little while to get them the way I wanted them. I believe they sound around 90% close to the original sounds and I had so much fun creating this one but let's not take too much of your time and let's go over the layers I have here for each section. Let's go ahead and just get started with the white layers on the right side and when the mat whale is down for that, that is going to be for the intro, for the verse and the pre-chorus. And then once you go into the chorus, the white layers come down. And when you turn the mat wheel up, it's going to be for the chorus. And these are the sounds for when the mat wheel is down. That is the pre-chorus run. And this is the verse. Once you turn the mot wheel up, then you get this techno synth, which is going to be for this part. Now, on the orange layer here towards the middle, this is going to be for the chorus. And this is the interesting one right here. I love the sounds right here. And that really doesn't matter if you have the mod wheel up or down. They're going to be there the whole time. So just be careful not to play on that part because then you're going to hear those. And you don't want those in the pre-chorus or the verse. So next section on the uh, purple layer. So when the mod wheel is at 0%, that's going to be for the intros and the verse. When you go to the pre-chorus, you turn it up to 50% and uh, it brings up some different ARPs. So when it's down, this is for the intro. And the verse as well. And then when you go to the pre-chorus, So for the pre-chorus is C, D, E, and then A minor. Remember these are chord triggers so you're not actually playing chords, you're just playing the notes. And uh, now the, this is, this is the, both of these red layers on the left, the, so that's going to be E minor and then G. And what that does is uh, you have to play that run right before you go into the chorus and those the same way those are going to be on the whole time so you don't need to turn the mod wheel up or down to do that but as you're doing this ones right here you have to turn the mod wheel up so you can go to the next section which is the the chorus and you're going to need this sound here so that's right before the chorus all right so those are the sounds for the entire patch now let's just go ahead and go over this section so you know what you have to play all right so the first thing i'm going to show you is going to be the intro so with the intro like i say you're going to play the purple layer and when the mod wheel is at zero percent you're going to play the white layer towards the right side this is what you do with the left hand so it's e minor c d a minor Now with the right hand, you're going to do So that's what you do there Now let's put both of them together
for the intro, you just do this part right here. I mean, for the verse. For the pre-chorus, my will 50% up. do this right after those two then you're gonna add this part same pre-chorus part so that's how that goes right before you go into the chorus and remember to raise the my wheel up as you're playing this part right here. So when you do this, the mount wheel has to be up so you can transition into the next section, which is gonna be the chorus and is the Now, this one's a little tricky. Uh, I still haven't gotten it down exactly how it goes because you got to play something different with the right hand and then something different with the left. And there's a few chops you have to do. And uh, right up. Just want you to know that I haven't learned the part completely, but I want to show you what both things uh, do individually. And then I want to try to put it kind of sort of together. But hopefully, you get the point of what it's supposed to sound like. So that was the first section that I did on this side. Now what you have to do here with the synth line is going to be this. And you repeat that over and over. So it's the same uh, loop, if you will. That's if you do it slow now on the right tempo. And uh, if we put them both together, I'm going to try. Like I said, I haven't done it. I haven't learned it all the way, but it will require some practice. So that's kind of sort of how that goes like I said I still haven't learned it all the way but hope you guys got the feel of what I'm talking about and do your part practice makes perfect now the very last section for this patch is going to be a piano that plays at the end and you're just doing this So that is it for this tutorial. I hope you guys liked it. Subscribe to my channel. If you have any questions, you can always leave us a comment or send us an email. One more time, this was Overflow by Planet Shakers. If you buy the patch, you're gonna get it in the key of D minor and E minor. I hope you guys have a great day.